death of my neighbor's cat. <laughs> Hey, we'll go back to our stupid rags to see what's up, Corbin. I'm Rick. You fall sick. Hit on Twitter. Juicy content. It's so juicy. Bang! And in case you forgot, shh. Also, I'm going to post on YouTube channels. Links right down there. Uh, that was from, uh, Home Alone 2. Wasn't, it, wasn't that also in Home Alone? Wasn't that the might same thing? Yeah, it might, have been. might be the Home Alone. Why were you... I have no idea. Just popped into my head. All right, there you go. I'm just quirky like that. Aww. Uh, quirky little Irishman. I know, I know. Today we're watching a trailer. Rick. Good, it's about time. I know, I know right? What that means. Uh, it's for a film called Roger. Not Roger. Roger. Oh, yeah, I thought you were saying... Roger. Roger! It was the, the, the biography of Scott Roger Moore. Scott Sterling, Roger! <laughs> Scott Sterling! Uh, anyways. Roger, Roger. This is Over, under. What's that from? Uh, Roger Taylor, I believe it's a Tamil film. Great. Uh, composed by A.R. Rahman. Great. Arvind Swami, Madhu, uh, Manarantham, and A.R. Rahman. Roja, translation Rose is a 1992 romantic thriller film written and directed by Mani Ratnam. It follows Roja, a simple girl from a village in Tamil Nadu, making desperate efforts to find her husband, Rishi Kumar, after he's kidnapped by militants during a secret undercover mission in Jammu and Kashmir. The, the theme of the film is based on the relationship between Savitri and Satyavan of the Hindu epic Mahabharata. Mm. A. R. Rahman debuted as music composer with this film. Oh, this is his debut film? Wow. Oh, that's interesting. And this is subbed by VG? Yes. Thank you, so VG. Thank you so much, guys. Wow, this is wonderful. I I'm, I'm love to see what, what he started I thought he was with. just always around. Yeah, right? Here we go. Whoever cut that trailer, fantastic Great job, job for being such an old film. 1992. Yeah. I would have put this early 2000s. Yeah, absolutely. Wow. That looked really, really good. Tamil film. Yeah. Aya Rahman first Debut, score. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I know like a compelling story. I know I've seen a lot of recommendations for this in the comments uh, for this film. Um, so before we start with anything else, let us know if this should be the next Tamil film we watch. I know there's a bunch. Yeah, uh, that we need to watch, but this is this looks pretty it's, compelling. It's really, really good. Uh, it's really, really interesting. Some of the shots, and I know they were supposed to be in uh, Kashmir, right? Yeah, that's Those what they the, said. Yeah, the mountain and region area for sure. Um, obviously, we've seen a couple in Family Man and a couple 
of other uh, films and, and uh, videos as well. Kashmir is freaking beautiful. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Uh, yeah, 1992. I know the name of that director too. What do I, what do I know him from? They'll say. Ah, That's it. Yes. Okay. So yeah, this is that director, the legendary director who they said don't judge him. Right, by Del Say. Of Del Say. And there's another one we just reacted to recently of his. Um, anyway, it was a new, like very, very new one, like coming out on Netflix or something. Money Run? Yeah, him. Um, we saw his guru. Uh, yeah, I don't remember. That was in 2007. That's with the, the young Bakchan, the Bakchan son. And how do you... Oh, I guess that's because the trailer. That wasn't an original trailer, because it said an A.R. Rahman musical, but if it was his debut, I'm sure it wasn't billed that way when it came out. No, I'm pretty sure that was a fan-made, yeah. Uh, yeah. fantastic fan-made, or the studio made it years later right, to re-release the trailer. And why wouldn't you make it his name right at the top? Yeah. yeah. The woman from the young village. In time when marries a sophisticated city dweller, moves with him to Kashmir, where all is rosy, nice, until he gets kidnapped by military. So is she, like, scared of him at some point? Well, it looks like an arranged marriage at first. Okay, gotcha. It looks like he comes and he wants to marry her, and she's like, uh, I don't think so. And then they actually fall in love with each other, and then he's kidnapped. Also, for such an old film, it's not that long. Yeah, it really, it's not. It's, it's Hour 37? Yeah. Was it, uh, no, that's, two, that's 217. 217? Yeah, not, not bad at all. Not Long bad time. for, I mean, for films of this era? Yeah. That's usually around three to three and a half hours. Yeah. Uh, for, for films. It looks good. I, if you guys say this is really, really good and this is the next Tamil film we should watch, I would be more than happy. Yeah. It looks fantastic. I don't think I recognize any of the actors. The only issue would be accessibility, obviously. That happens a lot of the times when we want to react to something we can't have access to it for some reason. Uh, regional films particularly, we often have a, a challenge with it being accessible or having subs. Especially if it's older. Pankaj Kapoor. That's not Shahid's dad, right? Uh, I don't know, but he was in frickin' Gandhi? And McBool. The Kapoor is spelled differently, so I don't think it is. I think it is. I think that's Shahid's dad. I don't know why his name is spelled differently. Why is his name spelled differently? Hold on. That's him. I'm gonna look it up. Hold on. That's him. Absolutely, that's, that's Shahid's dad. Shahid Kapoor. Yeah, that's him. And even the picture of him on IMDb, why did they spell his name wrong? Yeah, IMDb, okay, IMDb spells his name K-A-P-U-R -R. instead of O-O. And everywhere else it's O-O, so I don't know why he spelled that way, and even the picture doesn't really look like him. No, but oh, I do remember he was a, he was a fantastic Great actor. actor. Uh, <laughs> I, and I think we, McBool. We, we saw him in McBool. Yeah, that was the thing we talked about. Oh, okay. Haven't we seen him in... But what? also it said that he was in Gandhi, which has been so long since I've seen Gandhi. Oh, the with, the, with Ben Kingsley. I still haven't seen it. Yeah. Maybe, we, maybe I should... By the that. way, when Gandhi came out, it won everything, right? Ben Kingsley won an Oscar for Best Actor. It won Best Picture. It won like 10 Academy Awards. Mm -hmm. But I have no idea if Indians like that film. If it's an accurate depiction of Gandhi, if it's a bad depiction, a bad depiction of India. Well, you know, everybody has their own opinions of Gandhi. Oh, uh, but they, <laughs> setting that aside. Uh, Regardless of how you feel, because obviously there's two camps yeah, definitively about Gandhi. Gandhi. Yeah. Um, but from what I've heard, it, most people are like, yeah, that was a good film. From, uh, from Indians? From Indians. Okay. Because it's not like Slumdog. You know how most right no even though it's even like, though the issue with Slumdog is not that it's a quality film because I think most agree that it is actually a quality it's a well film. done film it's how it presents it's India. how it presents India and, right and I think the main issue is that the first big thing that Americans have noticed about India is slums is slums I think that was the biggest agreed thing. agreed uh, because it's actually a well done film right um, but yeah that's not what this is about and, um, and little trivia for you you may know this you may not know this I know you do mm. or do you I don't know you haven't said it yet what well, actor has a very, very small role in Gandhi. It was one of their first roles ever ben on Kingsley. screen. No. Uh, they play just this street punk that steps in front of Gandhi and the priest that's walking down the street with him and they act like they're gonna rough him up and then move on. It's maybe two minutes of screen time Martin for Sheen. one of the greatest 
actors of all time, and I'll give it away. Daniel Day Lewis. My favorite actor of all time. Yes, Daniel Day Lewis is in Gandhi. He has, he's on screen for about two minutes, maybe two minutes. I'm seeing if he's correct. Oh, yeah, he is. There he is. Nice. Yep, very, very tiny. He just pops in. You're like, what the? Anyway. Uh, I've never seen it. Yeah, I, I saw it when it came out. Anyways, uh, on this one, Roger. Roger! <laughs> Roger! Roger! Yeah. Uh, let us know about this film, and if uh, this should be one of the next uh, Tamil films we watch, please down, down. below.